Catch that again. Gets it with ultimate. Goes in with Q. Gets the W in before Flandre can put smoke screen down. Flandre goes in for some sustain. Gets the stun. Ooh, doesn't matter. Nice on the knock. It's gonna be very Boya cannon barrage and follow with by uh probably gonna start with Zoe's damage. Oh wow, two perfect execution there to Bayer. Well he knows he's dead. Doom, see you later. Flashes out from underneath the tower that paradox. Anyway, LWX as well. Here's the fight. Heroic entrance again. LWX takes two. Let's just give him the third. Zooms over the wall, but there is an angry Kaiser in my face. You got See if he got the stun. He missed the stun. He uses his ultimate, but he's just done. I don't know what else to say. Lila, wonderful. I'm happy. Can't deal with the Maokai. The Maokai gets low tank in Boing. I want to put him in the lane. Oh, the Maokai's opening up. Urgent up. here gives you his place enough time. Here comes Doobie into the middle. They can't escape now. We There's get the goal. It's both of them. As Gangplank Dolphy comes down as well. Now Gimpio for the 1v2. This Let's is go. Dual for the world and underneath current. Who's tanking up? It's ADD turned over to Meteor. Now with the Rifthel still charging away. The flash away oh. from Gimpio. One more hit. One more. The minions are doing it. The minions <laughs> have done it. Oh, the roar of the Slayer as well. Can't get the slowdown. And ADD doesn't deal with him. Ultimate form. They find the kill first onto T. And now for the quick pick up from BLG is FPX. Not sure whether to go back here, but Kimbun has also win this fight. Two man divine judgment comes on down, but zero damage this early on. Kuro bites it. Here, all of that out. Fight going down from top laner to top laner. Jinu pretty low. Give him, can he find the perfect oh, execution? No. Pop them all. And now Jinu running under the tower. Not going to be able to find anything. And Gimbu the leash is though by the Kale and the help of the rest of BLG. Pushing away from the inhibitor. Meteor coming in. Two rads. The burst. The flash. Meteor now re engaging. So the fight of a Gimbu in. Clutching Maelstrom. Turns to the re engage. Last threat from Doanby. Cataclysm down. Death down. Triple kill for Doanby. Okay, what happens here? Because Kim Goon might have the advantage to lose on hit, remember? Vladimir looking for the Crimson Rush. He'll find oh. it! He'll find the solo kill as well! In 3, 2, 1! That was great from FBX. You can, they were starting to peel back, and I thought that was going to be the better call to look Okay! Whoa. Okay, Kim Goon. Okay! Oh, he needs to find a way out of this one. He's got the shot for the time being. Nice looking for it. He's got the ward on tonight. This is literally just going to be a gift. He's out. Oh my god! No, he's going to get spotted. Flash plant. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, he, he has the perfect execution. Gimgun still has the flash. He flashes over the wall. We spotted out here by XX. So we know this is happening, but will they still take the 2v2 onslaught of Shadow Planet on the both members? Oh. But FPX, what a kill. With the magical journey and then getting it. Hang on, here we go. Nether Grass again. Walls coming in. Gimgun is not surviving. He's hitting burning. Onto who? What? Onto the wreck side. I think he can take that to the second. On the two, he's gonna find the first pick there on the Haro. Holder gets low. The stair cage keeping him alive for now. Guardian Angel has been popped. Jungle is still alive at the back of the fight, but he's incredibly low. Holder gonna get taken. Here we go. Right, so I'm just gonna run straight at him here. Here comes the Nocturne. He's the play already down. Flash in the turn for Ryzo. He's not messing around too well. Wants to take it up, but the stun comes in. No and the health regen is gonna be in. Do be needs to get in there as well. He has to slide it away, but over the top of him. Upside into Doobie, he gets over the top of Arrow comes in. He flashes, but not away from it. In the same direction. Katie needs to walk on into Doobie, who gets kicked back, knocked down, and knocked down. And Kim Goon does it again. The surge of lightning. Put a fork into the power point. The same. This is the toughest part here for life. Like, he's consistently playing this situation. He keeps taking a lot of media pressure. He flashes. He said easy, he rides the flash for flashes. We're waiting for the leap to come out once again. The box is there. He's back there. Oh, my God. He's in the bad position. He's 
Wait, here we go, down as well. Oh no, he's left alone. He's running for his life. He has no help whatsoever. The obliterate comes down. Sapson finally gets up there. Flashes over the wall, but Gibson wants to take him. He obliterates one more time and eats up. Gibson comes back around. He's back into the fight. He's more than kind of hungry for more. Getting the best series from FBX and IG. He's chasing around. There it is. Comes out on the Gibson. He drags back in. On the right. The death row there. The corking gun escapes. He's burning. He gets at this towards the top side. That means that Gibson, yeah, he was the strongest person on the walk. Again, he packages in. Gibson gets the passive up. Shields up. Another solo kill. That big daddy water climb. The big thunder flight of pressure is built. Busting Mouse from towards the top lane. Death Realm. There we go. We see it all. Great flash from the side. He got to the way. Gibson getting low. Who would he want? But 369 was surprised. And the moment he sees forward, gets the optimal combo right on top of it. We'll see a present lands on the Gim Goon. Will he turn with 369 so close? He walks on in into the Elise who gets low. He spins again. Gim Goon finds the kill now on the 369 with him. Coming oh, no. on. Here they come. The Capri's in. XX looks for the Cocoon. Doesn't land and goes into a belt. Flush hit. Spot Knight. Lock him in under Dark. Gim Goon is still alive. He's excited to flick him. Gim Goon with Dark. There he goes. He's dead. 3 and 0. Silas in. Let's go. Very careful, goes into the death round. Goes like spicy but what? gets pounded into the ground. Oh, people are going to try and cave their way in, but Culling hits the middle, Hex and Culling puts them. The AOA is going to come through, Kim Goon goes to half health, but the ultimate use once more. Here for the Biker, Reach Bonds to wreak havoc, and Elder Rick snaps it on. Manica still be there, but he wants to stop the teleport. He doesn't have it, but FBX still going to get the Nexus turret. Nexus exposed. They get high, boy. Keep your fuck they get it anyway. <laughs> he can't leave. But yeah, it's up. And Mirage Burst will stop hunting at half elf. I don't know if this is good. Uzi comes in. Flash immediately burned into the blind. Oh, Uzi oh. takes one too many. All right. Oh. It's cartoon time. Gimbu doesn't have much HP. He's fading, but he does have the bar up for the shield. He can take this in. Cocker getting in the hill. It's a flash for flash. They react to each other. Oh. And it's solo kill time. With Death Crush just about available. Gim Goon will take the... He needs to be able to sustain yourself. Oh, he can see now. He's pushing. The Zerse's here. Fantastic positioning. The flash forward from... Oh, oh. oh solo. That's how you escape the game. Help him out, make sure that uh, Yaya isn't applying too much pressure. It's the same can't be said for the top. Alright, Sarah's level 5, got flash available. He's gonna get caught out. He's gonna flash into the mini wave by some time. Here comes Levi, not gonna be enough to save Xerox's life. Levi trying to get a response back. The crocodile's the target, but Tia's coming forward. The Q from Kim Goon keeps him alive! Kiana ultimate knocked away the engage tools. You see a bit of an all in from Xerox. Trade of ultimates thus far. Xerox gonna look to flash the wall. Wait, man, used to pull it off. Give Goon follows. Yamsang has gone far too deep, but the ultimate will buy just enough time. Time lash available. That will tag one. Give comes over. Far into the wall. The rest of Fnatic. The baby. Oh, here. The giant is coming. Yeah, he will not be there in time to stop the Drake. There will be no flash available. Do it, Nick. Just get blown up. If Victor standing now needs to be saved. That's a great kickback from Tia. That's another kill. As long as he continues to push forward, he's already used to kill his team. Tia steps forward in great war rush. Now the Shite is in trouble. Death Run will wear out in just a moment. All of a sudden, Rocky Crab is flashed away from him. The engage from Ding. He catches LWS. Give him done his job. He's lost inside the Shite in the Death Run. And Tia, why are you on the chickens? Why are you on the raptors? FPX are routed, are running for their lives. FPX are getting wrecked. Give Goon almost wins the 1v1 against the Shite. He gets a gigantic shield. Gets the 2 8 carries on one side. And what LWX and the other side from Special Zero. Who comes in? All right, the Dad's in. The Indian with races. They're available. Battle line is in so much trouble. There's so much damage in the back line. Now LWX goes in with a killer instinct. He's been able to force the hourglass from Rookie. The barrel from Ning by so much time. It's 2 for 2. That's 4. Ning is now trying to do something around. Tia finds a fight. Do it. He goes down the Shite. We'll get killed. 4 plus Phoenix. Yeah, it's on the bottom half of the map. But then it's just playing right into it. Oh, here we go. Aims are pushing heavily in favor of Invictus Gaming. And now the Shy, he's starting to chase forward. The barrels come down though. Jacking up the Shy being blown up. Why Jacking up the How did you do this? Or Invictus Gaming tilted? It's extremely 
high. It's what we wanted to see from FPX. Push out a lane, roam to a side lane. The difference is it was Gimgoon's gangplank with the...